several hours after causing a fatal accident that killed nine people and injured seven others, Luong Van Tam, 28, turned himself in at the local police station, Vu Than Kuang, director of the province's police department, told Vian Express. At the provincial hospital, the driver tested positive for meth, Kuang said. Heroin metabolites can be detected in urine tests one to three days after the last use. On Monday afternoon, the truck was traveling on National Highway 5 from Hanoi when it hit a group of commune officials who were walking along the road. They were returning to work after burning incense at the local martyrs' cemetery. The accident happened in Kim Than District in Haiduong, around two hours to the east of Hanoi. An eyewitness said the victims were walking in the motorbike lane. Deputy Prime Minister Zhang Hoabin has ordered an urgent probe into the accident, with results reported the government before the Lunar New Year Tet holiday. Drug use is not rare among Vietnamese truck drivers who have heavy workloads, say people familiar with the matter. An inspection by the Transport Ministry of 136,000 drivers in 2014 found 526 using drugs. Road crashes are a leading cause of deaths in Vietnam, killing almost one person every hour. A total of more than 18,720 traffic accidents occurred in 2018, killing 8,244 people and injuring nearly 14,800, according to the National Traffic Safety Committee. Earlier this month, four people died and 16 others were injured in southern Long and province after a truck slammed into motorbikes waiting at a traffic light. The 32-year-old truck driver was later found to have been high on liquor and heroin. The video is sponsored by cintronic.com.